going on everybody? My name is Joey Nato and I'm actually a rapper, music producer, singer, uh, YouTuber. I make music that sounds like this. Oh, bitch. Listen now, man, they treat me like a god. Hurt me right now, this ain't no facade. And today we're venturing out into something new. We are looking at beatbox videos. It was requested for the first time. Actually, here, let me let me check right now. Just type in comments. Let's put beatbox. Alright, beatbox was requested a lot. Damn. Debbie do we do ya three years ago. Okay. Well, never say never. Did I put on my headphones to search on my computer? It's weird energy. But I, I started the whole music producer reacts thing on YouTube. So there's a box that I haven't checked off yet, and that's reacting to beatbox videos. I'm excited to check this out. Lucky squad never give up. Let's get into it. Alright, this video is 10 minutes long. God damn! Here we go. Zeka. Oh, we're doing melodies too? Okay, so, so, okay, it's impersonation. That's what this is basically. So we're impersonating the instruments, right? Of whatever, you know, you, you would hear in typical music. The reason why this is such a vibe for a lot of people, I think, is because it reminds them of those, you know, those EDM drops when it has those sustained, long, distorted bass notes. It's usually like an 808 or some kind of synthesized bass line that's just has that distortion and that crunch to it and then when he punches back in with those you know super hard kicks the kicks are when he's like puh, puh, when he's doing that but he does it into the mic yeah, see that's my all right i'm just spitting all over the place at this point <laughs> but that's what's the break in the action and you feel when the bass hits Ooh. UK the breakbeat drill. drum fill you can live GBB. collapse Ooh, this is kind of like a little percussion run here with these 16th notes. Oh, nah, nah, okay, that's where it's getting crazy. So, these these constant hits he's doing is the snare drums, the t or t or whatever. This is gonna be stupid. I, I don't know if I could do this video. But anyways, in between that is those little percussion, like, little clicks he's doing. That's crazy. I don't know how he's doing that. <laughs> Like that's mm. they even have pitch changes to them in between. That's what I do. That's a dope beat. How? How do you do that? I like how like all the bass drops too had different character to them. Some had a little bit more of texture than others. <laughs> my my guy looked like he was about to pass out. I, like, oh. I would say that kind of had the uh, the the equivalent type of sound as like um like the DJ scratch. You know what I mean? Cut codes. I like how these are very unconventional patterns, too. Oh, he's doing a four to the floor type thing there. He's including a kick with his snares. Boom, boom. The triplet patterns? What is this? Time. I don't go with the basic flow and I bump jump, jump, everybody get throw. I don't go with the basic flow and I bump jump, jump, everybody get jump, jump. I don't roll with the same old flow. And I, I like that they add the little rap bump. in there. I don't go with the basic so flow. the raps don't have any depth to the sounds like the beatboxing sounds do. You know what I mean? So it's kind of like to give you a light feel. So in comparison, when that bass comes in, it just hits way harder. I, bump, I love jump, that. Bump, it's all a tease. <laughs> Oh, 
look at the crowd, boy. <laughs> Putting it in his face. I don't probe with the basic flow, man. Oh, he's cheating. He's cheating. Having the hey, hey, hey. He's got, he's got the, uh, the, the vocal effects now to compliment his beat. Probe with the basic flow, with up, with up, with up. I don't throw it up. He's talking wild beatboxing. How sway? You don't clap because I kill him on a track. Oh, I love how they can put a note in there. That's like an actual synth bass, like pluck note. Womp, womp, womp. Ooh, that's got to bounce. I know this guy is like an all-time great at this, but I was sleeping on him the most at the first. MB14. Okay. It's interesting because that fuzz is giving it like an 8-bit feel. Okay, where are we going with this? Oh, we're doing reverse effects? Like, like that, and he's doing it so subtly and so smooth. That's like verifying Pro Tools. It makes the sound go That's the most like in rhythm crowd I've ever heard. They're perfectly on beat. <laughs> so those, all those, like, kind of take the place of toms, you know, on a drum set, like the do doom do doom do doom. That's kind of like what those are impersonating right there. Is that his competition vibing with him? What a good sport. The art. Don't ever call him Bart. Oh, his bass lines are nasty. Oh, this really sounds like an EDM buildup with the snares. So what does it take to be a judge listening to this stuff, man? Like, what are you listening for? What are you deciphering through? You know what I mean? For me, like listening to this for the first time, you know, I'm just kind of just fascinated by what sounds they're trying to replicate. You know what I mean? When you're actually like making a beat or, you know, using these type of instruments. I'm just trying to figure that out. But I wonder what they're listening for. They're probably listening for like articulation, how much they're like staying on beat, maybe breath control, maybe those type of things. Mm. Ooh. That rumbly bass. That's That's almost like an open hat. Ooh. Oh, that's such a unique noise. How did. No. No. What was that roll? They even were changing pitches. They went. How? Okay, <laughs> here's the amazing thing about that. This little melody he has complements it or like bouncing off the beat. But he's doing it in a way when he's hitting those notes, he's like backing away from the mic. Like it has to be like centimeters away just to make sure he gets that reverb noise in that melody. So it's not dry like. 
He wants to sound like But the only way to do that is to give the, the mic a little bit of room so it casts out that reverb. That's crazy. This guy's sounds are so crisp. This guy's amazing. <laughs> They're really creating a whole dubstep track with their mouth and a mic. The amplification of the mic is important. I do want to hear what these sound like without the microphone's ampli amplification, you know? Oh! That's the best clap sound I've heard so far. Imperna impersonation of a clap. Oh, it is wild. <laughs> Bro. Why did the judges not look impressed by that? You know, it's like everything else they were like, okay. That one they were just like, fix your face. This greatness. All right, now they're into it. Oh man, they were just waiting for the drop. I love this dude's clap noises. <laughs> I love his percussion, man. <laughs> that was like a little electric block. Ooh, his bass is hitting. Bro, I swear you gotta listen with headphones like these. Ooh, the reverse. The growls of his bass lines are wild, man. They got so much texture to them. Mmm, grittiness in them. I love it. You want to put the higher bass? This guy is a mutant. More D -Lo. Bro, it took me a second to realize that's one person <laughs> making that noise. I was like, ah, ah. I was like, okay, that's cool and all. And I was like, wait a minute, he's doing the, he's doing everything. How? How many vocal cords do you have? I am not a psycho. I just when they call the alchemist. What was it like to be this guy's parent? To just hear him doing this in the other room all damn day. <laughs> like, son, what are you doing? It's like, sorry, mom and dad, I'm just one of the most talented people on the face of the fucking planet. I don't get how he's doing this. I am not a psycho, but just when they go to the alchemist. And there were such light sounds, you know, in like the high frequency range or mid to high frequency range. So he's just playing around with those, just playing around with those. Then he does the little vocal, the little rap thing, which is like right, right in the low mid. And then he brings you down to the low frequency where all the basses and everything. That was beautifully constructed. Monkey. Yeah, it's the face expressions of the audience. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Ooh, codfish. Nice build up. Oh, he's mixing in the sub bass in between. Mm. Oh. Yeah, 
That's crazy. Woo! He's like, I'm not done. Wow. So we are going under. That was insane. I wasn't ready. Appreciate you guys watching. I'll see you in the next one. Nada. I'm the wrong things. I talk millies, you talk memes. I talk really, you talk dreams. Your flow silly, my flow.